I want to quickly show you how to fade your video to black at the end of your video. I'll also show you how to dip to black between two different clips and I'll show you how to dip from black in the beginning of your project as well. The first thing you want to do is go to Windows and go to Workspace, change yours to default editing. So you look at the exact same thing I'm looking at here. Next, there is a box here called Effects and in the search box, look for dip to black. There's a dip to black option that is a dissolve. All you have to do is grab it and apply it to the end of your clip like this. Just drag and drop it. Now, if I go over here and if I press play, it's going to dip to black just like that. Now, by default, if you double click these, these are one second long, but you can type in a different number. For example, three seconds long is going to get you a much longer dip to black or fade to black. You could always grab it too and change the duration just like this, as long or as short as you like. Now to do this between two clips, you do the exact same thing, drag and drop it and put it right here between two clips. If it doesn't fall exactly in between, you could select it, go up here to effects control and make sure you change the alignment to center at cut. Right there, you see how it moved to the center because it will sometimes start this way or end this way, but typically I like to keep a center. I'll show you what that looks like. Press play. And that's what dip to black looks like. And in the very beginning, it's the same thing as the end. Just put it in the beginning like this and then go ahead and press play. And that will dip your project from black into your video. I hope you found this useful and I'll see you next time.